It is a perfect day in quiet suburbia. Springtime. Promiscuity and immoral activity among teenagers are becoming a growing epidemic. This is Billy and Mary. They have been together for quite a while now, but lately they have become more curious, and this could lead to harmful consequences that they do not know about. Oh yes, Billy. Those urges you have can become dangerous to your health and hers. But do not worry. I am here to show you how to avoid these dangerous consequences. Young scholars Billy and Mary are hard at work finishing up their algebra homework. Now to truly understand how to avoid these dangerous consequences, you have to know the expected standard for premarital relations in our society, or what I like to call the gold standard. Wouldn't you kids like to be a part of the gold standard? Of course you would. Now the gold standard for school-age children like yourselves is to practice abstinence. To abstain is to avoid promiscuous activity. This is the standard we live by in our society and should be followed in order to avoid dangerous consequences. Look at Billy and Mary enjoying their cold delicious milkshake. But what they do not know is that sharing a simple milkshake can lead to something more serious. That's right, Billy. An intimate milkshake can lead to immoral activities, which can lead to many dangerous consequences. What kind of consequences, you ask? Premarital relations will often lead to out-of-wedlock pregnancies, social diseases, and terrible psychological effects, including depression and delinquency. Yes, kids. Having premarital relations can be very dangerous for children your age and should be avoided at all times to prevent these horrible consequences. Billy and Mary are enjoying a nice afternoon at home watching Milton Berle while Mary's parents are at work. Oh no, Mary. You must not let him make any advances towards you. This can lead to more serious activities, which will eventually lead to dangerous consequences. Oh no, Billy. You must abstain from taking drugs and alcohol because it will increase your desire to make advances and Mary's likelihood to fall prey to them. Good job, Billy and Mary. Another crisis averted. Now that we have reached the end of our educational experience, you kids must be wondering what would happen if you gave in to these urges. Well, children, there is no foolproof way to avoid these undesired consequences other than abstinence. Contraceptives do not necessarily protect you from STDs and condoms have too high of a failure rate. The only way to protect yourself is to completely abstain. Thanks for all your help today. We really learned a lot. No. Thank you, Billy and Mary. Thank you. Hello? Hey, what's up? Yeah, I just finished this sex education class. It was really cool. Okay, I'll see you in a few minutes. Bye. Let's go. Bye. Bye.